he's not that handsome. You're just attracted to mystery or something. Who is tra- attracted to mystery? I mean, yes, of course I am. She's I'm, a- I'm not. No, I like to be. I like very upfront delivery of goods. Delivery of goods. No, no shady biz. I'll say this about you. <laughs> you were a lot more handsome and attractive before we knew everything about you. <laughs> <laughs> when you were a mysterious orphan with mysterious ties to a strange water god, that was sexy. Now you're just some creeper who uh, just... What? Well, I, I think it was more the accent, really. That, too. Yeah. This accent what? is so plain. This might be the worst thing That's everyone's ever said to me. This <laughs> is insanely harsh. Yeah, I grew up in an orphanage, yeah. This, I think your accent now is wonderful. <laughs> so do I, but it was... I just had never... I have never heard it. I- Society, do piety a piety the gods all suffer silently i'm sorry for my obsession with attention i have an ungodly fear of rejection what i need is a human connection they find my disinterest interesting my depression a funny thing my decline is relatable people love that i hate myself yeah they love that i hate myself people love that i hate myself people love that i hate myself people love that i hate myself who am i and when are these my colleagues or my friends on a scale of 10 to 1 do you hate who I've become? Because I hate who I've become. Are you feeling nervous? Are you having fun? I want to watch the world burn. I got the gasoline. I want to watch the world burn and everyone gain. Welcome to the internet. Have a look around. Um, there's things that I don't want to come across in my show that I worry often come across about me, because people don't realize that it's an act up here. I don't want you to ever think that I think I'm better than people, or that I think I know better than people. Um, anyway, sorry. Okay. Uh, this is a song from the perspective of God. Pray so badly for heaven. I went to Kanye West's recent tour, the Yeezus tour. It was a big, dramatic, theatrical show. He did something very strange at the end of his show where he ranted for like 20 minutes, it was kind of a rant, kind of a song. He had auto-tune on his voice, and there was an instrumental in the background. Like this instrumental. I can fit my hand inside a Pringle can. I can get my hand like four inches into the can, but then I have to tilt the can into my mouth. But by that point, a bunch of crumbs have accumulated at the bottom of the can. So they all go spill it out of my face. Come on. If you feel me, put your hands up. Look at all these hands that are way too big to fit inside a Pringle can. I don't go to the gym because I'm self-conscious about my body. But I'm self-conscious about my body because I don't go to the gym. Irony can be so painful. That's a catch-22. The truth is my biggest problem's you. I want to please you, but I want to stay true to myself. I want to give you the night out that you deserve, but I want to say what I think and not care what you think about it. A part of me loves you. Part of me hates you. Part of me needs you. Part of me fears you. I don't think that I can handle this right now. Look at them, they're just staring at me like, come and watch the skinny kid with a steadily declining mental health. And laugh as he attempts to give you what he cannot give himself. But I know I'm not a doctor. I put on a silly show. I should probably just shut up and do my job. So here I go. You can tell them anything if you just make it funny, make it rhyme. And if they still don't understand you, then you will run it one more time. But you don't even know the half of this right now. Right now. Ha! Now. Right now. Thank 
you. Good night. I hope you're happy. You shine, come on in, the water's fine. You say the ocean's rising like I did.